Hi there, my name is Sanjeev and I'm a member of Data School's 40th cohort at the Information Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Hexbin map. For this example, I'm going to use data on crime in LA and create a Hexbin map ranking each area by number of crimes committed. So let's jump right into Tableau and get started. Step 1. Create a parameter. Start by opening Tableau and creating a new parameter named ratio. Make sure to set the data type to float and for now let's keep the initial value as 1. Now let's create a calculated field called hexbin x. We'll use the hexbin x function which takes the longitude and latitude values and multiplies them by the ratio parameter. Then we will divide this result by the ratio. This calculation will help us distribute the data points effectively. We then need to duplicate the hexbin x calculated field and edit it. First rename it hexbin y, then adjust the function to hexbin y and click OK. After, we can drag both hexbin x and hexbin y calculated fields to the dimension shelf. Now right click on both calculated fields in the dimension shelf and convert them to continuous. To proceed, we need to change the geographical role of both calculated fields. Assign longitude and latitude to hexbin x and hexbin y respectively. Place both hexbin x and hexbin y onto the sheet. As we do this, you'll notice the hexbin start to take shape, but we're not done just yet. Show the ratio parameter control on the tableau sheet and you now can interactively adjust the density of the hex bins. Let's change this to 50 for now. To add a bit of visual flair to the map I will put crime ID data onto the colour shelf and change it to account. Then apply a quick table calculation to transform it to a rank. Next we will format the colour to red and blue diverging. We now have different colours and rankings assigned to different data points, making our hexbin map even more informative. Finally, to achieve the distinctive hexagonal shape we desire, change the default shape of the data points to a hex. We can do this by changing it to a shape and clicking more shapes. From here select the shape palette with a hexagonal shape inside of it and click OK. I'm now going to change the ratio value to 100 and increase the size of the shape. To add more context, let's include the count of crime IDs onto the tooltips. And there you have it, you have successfully created a Hexbin map in Tableau. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you now feel more confident in creating Hexbin maps. Please check the description of this video for links to additional materials that you might find useful. If you enjoyed this video, I think you'd absolutely love the related how-to videos by my fellow data schoolers. Click on the thumbnail on the bottom right to watch it next. Subscribe to this channel to get notified when we release new videos.